What is going on YouTube? Jimmy Little here. Hope everyone's having a great day today. No doubt crew, I've been grinding the heck out of this game for the last couple of days. I'm almost done with the majority of the career arcs. Um, we're going to be debuting Gary Carter today. We just unlocked him. I think I'm completely done with Gary Carter. Even did the last mission. Utley, we're, we're right there. I just need exchange. I think I'm a couple stubs short. Uh, I'm probably going to buy some stubs today. Molitor, we got him too. We, we, get, we unlocked a bunch of stuff. We're almost, we got like 30 more runs to go here. And then we'll have Larry Doby. Uh, Saberhagen, it's not too far. We're, we're almost done with a lot of stuff. We even got this coming soon. So if you guys want to see this soon, it's a Diamond Mike Piazza. Uh, you know, just hit the like button. Um, but anyways, uh, the squad we're going with today looks pretty much the same. I did make a couple changes. Uh, Jim Carter, or excuse me, Jim Edmonds, Gary Carter. Here's what he looks like. He may be the best catcher in the game diamond hitting and fielding hitting 76 93 contact power 65 89 so of course he excels versus hitting lefties 93 power he is a right-handed stick also plays first base uh fielding 86 arm strength 87 and accuracy 83 reaction 72 and blocking 87 so that's absolutely phenomenal uh, i just try to get a bunch of doubles with him so i haven't really used him a lot i was just power swinging looking for the for alleys i think i needed doubles with catcher uh, to go ahead and finish my piazza. But anyways, enough talking. Let's jump into this game. Here is the Gary Carter debut. All right, here we go. We are home. So I did pick uh, City Field. Almost said Shea Stadium because that is one of the places Gary Carter played. But here's his team. Scott Kingerly, which is a pretty solid card. Billy Williams, Justin Bohr, J.D. Martinez, Trevor Story, Shohei Otani, Chase Utley, Wilson Contreras, and Derek Holland. So he's got that player of the month. Uh, Shohei Otani's got a lefty on the mound, which could help us because we got Gary Carter. So let's see if we can we can get jumping right off the bat. But I made a mistake. I put zero lefties in my bullpen. That was an accident. That's what happens when you only have one lineup and you're constantly swapping your normal starting team versus the team that you're grinding. But may, hopefully for him will be 19. It'll be there. We haven't been asking for this for a couple years now. Now, like I said, I do have a bunch of cards uh, that I will be debuting. Going to buy some stubs, so I might buy a couple more cards as well. Let me know what cards you want to see. I'll probably buy like 150k stubs. Probably 50 of those will have to go towards finishing collections and buying souvenirs and whatnot. So let me know down below, and uh, I'm going to record some videos. And, you know, if you guys hit the like button and stuff like that, I'll just make the videos public. While I hang cutters up, but get them in just enough for a fly ball to left. Right into the shift. Cano's going to drop at 17 speed. Thank God it was Justin Bohr. All right, so he does got a lefty on the mound. So half of my lineup is kind of screwed. Even more because some of my righties hit better versus lefties. I, wow, 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 wow. Like, I saw that the whole way, and I was just like, I don't think he's going to get to this ball. All right, so completely missed the ball, but ended up with a triple. And now we got Gary Carter. And here's a chance for him to bring our first run of the game in. That was, that was just bad. All right, so this inning has been a complete train wreck, like, all around. And then I'm swinging a knuckle curves on the round. All right, I'm going to focus up. Next inning is going to be a little bit of a different inning. I, I promise. Next inning is going to be a little bit different. I've been using Hanley a lot lately. And it's been working for me. Another triple. Another triple. And that one's a legitimate triple. We just missed a home run. At a boy, Billy. At a boy, Billy. You just barely snuck into the lineup. And you're going to get an RBI single. At a boy. Oh, no. I actually thought that was going to sneak through. That was very weird for the shortstop to come in on that. Like the way he did. All right. Back to the top of the lineup. Oh, wait. Everyone's safe. What just happened? Disappointing. It's the only word for that. Grounding into a bunt double play. You're almost not even safe to bunt in this game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Shoei puts a charge into the corner. 
And that's going to be a double for Shoei with one out. I should have cut that off. I should have cut that off. I thought he was going to take out his pitcher and try to bring that run in, but he wants Derek Holland to stay out there. All right, a strike on the at-bat. But Miguel Cabrera comes in. He quick pitched me when my pitcher was up to hit. Interesting. And we hit that ball hard. It's going to get down. Miguel Cabrera comes in and gets a base hit. I don't think I have anyone that can actually run, though. There we go. That's a base hit. That's literally what we were looking for there. We're not going to go the extra base. Throw was a little offline. Maybe could have made it, but we got to run in scoring position. For Gary Carter, the table is literally set for you, Gary. 2-2 two, two count. I just needed you to fight that pitch off. All I needed was for you to fight that pitch off. All right, so my controller keeps dying mid-pitch, so I'm going to have to charge it after this game regardless. But here we go. 2-2 two, two count. We just missed a home run. Please do not throw me out on this because I will not be happy. There's our leadoff hit, baby. pull towards the line but any other time if it's if it's a home run just barely hanging in there it dips straight towards the line all right my last lefty bat Luis Gonzalez runner on first with one out and then back to the top of the lineup just avoid the double play that's all we need Luis Gonzalez pulled off of that one but we're back to the top of the lineup All right, Jim Edmonds can end it with one swing, or he can get it to Gary. That's a great spot. Good spot for my opponent. Great slider. Back-to-back -to -back tough pitches for my opponent. Got to give him that. Good fight. How did I miss that? How, 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 how? How now, Brown Cow? All right, here we go. Another 1-1 ball game into extra innings. My lord, I you just you just can't get tired of them. You just can't get tired of one-run ball games that go into extra inning and MLB the show. Thought hitting was patched. To DH, don't feel it. And ask and you shall receive. Tag! Let's go, baby! What a double play! Wow, what a double play! That's just a baseball player and me yelling tag. That was Gary Carter who made that double play happen. I let go of the PCI. I'm going to watch it in slow motion and watch my PCI go right towards the middle. And still, somehow, I end up under it, even though I was early, which means my PCI should have dropped down instead of up. Oh, no! Not even! Not even! That is what just happened. That is me not winning the game. Why can't I hit those in through the shift? Why can't he just stay back and just hit a ground ball through the shift there? Can you bring Pedro Alvarez off the bench and hit a home run on the first pitch? I'm having the same luck in every single game I play. Every single game I'm playing is playing out the exact same way. It goes me scoring very early, then I can't score, then my opponents can't hit the entire game, but then gets one run off of me. We go to extra inning for three innings sometimes, and then he hits a home run, and that's it. Where's my pitcher? Where's my pitcher? Where is my pitcher? That has been every single game I've played. It has been every single game I've played. All right, here we go. We're down by a run. Dylan Batanz is in relief. Let's try to get that run back at least. That one's ripped. They're playing me on the line, though. Got to be very careful. How did I get on top of that? How, Sway? I don't know how. I don't know how. All right, boys. Our last chance for romance. Nice little knuckle curve for my opponent. I'm going to need Billy Williams to get on base, ladies and gentlemen. That's a good cutter, but that's ball two. Come on, Billy. I got faith in you. Backdoor slurve was very sharp. I'll leave that there. It's all yours. 
And a weak pop fly to right center field. And my opponent's going to walk away with the W. But all right, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, that was Gary Carter. He made some nice defensive plays. And I completely forgot to get a thumbnail. But it's all good. Uh, that was my first game after the patch release yesterday. Um, I'm going to be honest. I don't. I didn't feel anything change. I don't, it literally felt the same. Uh, I've been hearing some mixed things. But anyways, let me know how you guys feel. Let me know who I should debut next. I do have a couple cards I need to debut. With. Uh, I'll have Chase out in a few minutes. Um, but I may buy some stubs because I had 14,000 stubs. It's not even enough for me to finish the collection for Chase Utley. Because between Jersey Exchange, Hat Exchange, and Player Exchange, um, it's roughly about 40, 40 to 50,000 stubs, which is about $40. But anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, if you did, make sure you smash the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Whose world is this? The world is yours. The world is yours. It's mine, it's mine, it's mine. Whose world is this? <laughs> It's mine, it's mine, whose world is this? The world is yours, the world is yours It's mine, it's mine, it's mine, I sip the dumb